Now, the WGAL News 8 Storm Team Forecast with meteorologist Ethan Houston. Lots of April showers out there across the Susquehanna Valley. Be prepared for a wet stretch of weather for the next few days. Widespread rain returns tonight. Could be heavy at times as we head through Thursday and showers are likely on Friday. It's not until the back half of the weekend when we finally start to see some breaks in the clouds and prolonged dry stretch of weather. Outside right now on our effort of sky cam, mostly cloudy skies may see some peaks of sunshine at times as we head through the afternoon, but there still could be some spotty drizzle as well. Well, in eastern Lancaster County right now we are at 58 degrees. The rain that we have this morning has dissipated. Uh, we are seeing some breaks in the clouds right now in the satellite that I've put over the radar. Just that may be uh, spotty at times through the afternoon. So there's this morning's rain. Here's this uh, evening and on into the overnight rain. And this is a slow moving storm. Storm is going to be heading up towards Quebec and that cold front is going to slowly push across the region heading through tomorrow. So for the rest of our Wednesday, mostly cloudy, perhaps a few areas of some drizzle and some mist with temperatures up near 60 degrees this afternoon for tonight. After midnight, the widespread rain will return. There could be some patchy fog with temperatures only dropping to the upper 40s. And then for tomorrow, widespread rain is likely. It could be heavy at times, especially in the morning and the afternoon. It will taper off later in the evening after sunset, and it's likely going to be cooler with highs only in the low to mid 50s. So here's a breakdown of the rain chances. They really start to go up after midnight on into closer to dawn. Here's a look at the rainfall totals so far since midnight more than a half inch rain in Harrisburg just over a third of an inch of rain in Lancaster right now it's 56 currently in Carlisle 57 in Gettysburg so close to average right now we do have warmer weather off down to the southeast and unfortunately strong to severe thunderstorms are possible across the southeast once again we're not going to tap into that warmer air but we certainly have one two three storms that will be moving over the region during the next couple of days finally high pressure that's building over the Rockies will push into the region as we head into the weekend. But until then, lots of clouds, rounds of showers are likely. So as we head through this evening, perhaps a break in the clouds at times, but most of us could just see uh, mostly cloudy skies to cloudy skies and some spotty drizzle. Overnight tonight, the widespread rain starts to move on in. It will intensify tomorrow morning through the afternoon as the area of low pressure along this frontal boundary will move overhead. Finally, after sunset, we'll start to see the skies clear, but showers will remain possible as we head on into Friday. Day. We could also see a few passing showers on Saturday. Finally, some drier weather, but it's going to be brisk again for our Sunday. Temperatures will start warming up above average and we stay dry for early parts of next week.